Hello. We are at the airport right now. Mm. We are getting ready to fly to San Francisco so for the exciting. meetup. Ah, I'm, I'm so very, happy. very excited. We just saw a therapy dog. Named Willow. Named Willow. So cute. And I didn't know that they had therapy dogs at the airport. I guess when you fly, some people get stressed out, so you need a cute little doggy to pet to make you feel better. <laughs> yeah, she was really, really cute. You are so beautiful. I cannot get over it. You do a great service here. You so you're a dog? You just bring her in? Yep, we just volunteer. I've never seen a belt that says, please pet me. I know, because I was like, I oh, does that say like, don't pet me? And I was like, wait, does please pet me? I know, please pet me. Please pet me. I know everybody thinks it's like, no, it's really, you can pet her. <laughs> like, around, like, no, she can be petted. Oh, but there's goodness. a lot of police dogs here that can't be petted, so. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, we're just waiting for a flight, and we'll be in San Francisco later. I'm so excited. I'm very excited. Seat. She has a window seat. I, love looking at I have an aisle because I pee too much. <laughs> so we have different priorities there. <laughs> So we're here at the hotel. Look how pretty this is. There's a little Japanese garden. We're staying at that Kabuki, Hotel Kabuki. And then there's like a Japanese garden over there too. I don't think I don't think I like it. Salt and oil is what we what we normally do. It's very chewy. It's very yummy. Is it? <laughs> it's so good. It's very tough. <laughs> and we are here with Santa. Hello. Yay! You want to have a Korean barbecue? Yes, I want the bulgogi. I love bulgogi. It's my favorite. Yeah. Look, he's starting it to curl like up. It looks like an alien or something. Yeah. Oh. oh, it's a little head. It's <laughs> Look. Oh, God. Oh, Look. Look. It's all curling up. Oh, 
body? The head freaks me out. You don't eat the head? I thought you eat it. I like the legs. The head freaks me out. <laughs> oh, just the head freaks you out, not the legs? But now the head's just like so. <laughs> I think you should eat the head. Have you ever eaten the head? Eat the head. 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 Spicy octopus. So it was good? Yeah, it's really good. No thanks. It's about to go down, people. <laughs> I'm to get over, maybe only kind of over again, then I'll have to get over you all over again. That was really out of my range, like, wow. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I got the, I got the. Baby, come line me up, and baby, I'll let you on it. A little bit dangerous, but baby, that's how I want it. If you can sign the bag the that bag? you beautifully designed. Mm -hmm. Where? Uh, anywhere. Anywhere you anywhere? want. I'll let you decide. Uh, okay. On I'm, the back is fine. I'm not good with decisions. Okay. Uh. Yay. Thank <laughs> you. I love yeah. you. So we're here at the meetup, and look who's here. What's it's Kechogi. Woo. So excited. I have loved you forever. You're super talented. So glad to meet you in real life. Yeah, no big deal, just taking a bath in a whole tub of squishies. Cover me. This is the best way to get clean, you guys. Cover me. <laughs> is it comfy? No. <laughs> well, I'm laying right on the... It's comfy on top of me. Yeah. <laughs> Am I covered? Chin up, I'm here with Maggie. Hi. She is the founder and owner of Moodle. Moodle. She is 16 years old and has made her own squishy line. Like what? How do you, like, I don't understand how you're a business owner at 16. Like what made was, you want to? It was tough. Um, I was really passionate about squishies and mm -hmm. I thought creating my own would be a really fun and interesting experience. So I just went with it. That's really awesome. I'm really jealous because I really want I don't like the squishies. But they're very cute. They are the little llamas. They're very, very cute. There's the two different colors. I'm going to put all of her information down below in the description, but make sure you check her out because she's 16. <laughs> and that's awesome. A big, big thank you to everyone who came to the meetup. It was so much fun seeing you guys. I got to meet Ketchup Gary, which was really cool. And Moodle Squish um, was the one who kind of organized this event. So big thank you to Maggie. She's amazing. She's 16. Like, it's so crazy to me that she literally made her own squishy and she's only 16. So this is actually a gift from Maggie that I'm going to open. So thank you so much to her. She gave me some matcha, um, the caramel corn snacks. Thank you so much for those. She gave me another one of her cloud llamas. Um, I had posted a picture of these on my Instagram, but it's a really cute little llama that she designed. I think it's so 
crazy that she made her own squishy. So this is the blue cloud llama and there's also a lavender color. Super cute little llama with a bell and little wings. She also gave me these little stickers of Mount Fuji, which are really cute. Thank you so much for these. I love Mount Fuji. I think it's so cute. She gave me this little donut squishy with a little smiley face and some candy. Thank you very much. Here is the little note. It has Shiba Inus on it. Oh, these are really cute. Cute little stickers. You're so kind, open-hearted, and so pretty. Wow, wow, I can't wait to meet you, Maggie. Oh my gosh, thank you so much, Maggie. It was so great to meet you, and I'm so glad that we got to get together at this event. So thank you so much for everything. Now I wanna show you all of these squishies that I got at Bunny's Cafe because she gave me a lot of them to show you guys. Okay, so first are the amazing Yummy Bear Hugging the ice cream cones. I love the squishy. Ooh, it's really, really squishy too. I feel like sometimes the yummy bear squishies are hit or miss with how squishy they are. So there are three different kinds. There's a strawberry, the original, and then rainbow. Super cute. I'm very impressed with how squishy this is actually. It's very slow. Ooh, I like this a lot. Then we have the rainbow one, which is really pearly and pretty. And these are really, really soft. I feel like sometimes Yummy Bear isn't as soft and these are really nice. And I like how big the ice cream is. It's fun to squish. Very, very cute. This one smells like rose though, I think it is. And I'm not a huge fan of the rose smell. Let me know in the comments if you are a fan of the lavender and the rose scents because I find them too strong. Then we have this ice cream cone yummy bear, which I'm gonna go ahead and open. Oh, it's so cute. I love the sprinkles on top and the face is adorable. I think this is peach scented. This one's really squishy too. I'm very impressed right now. This one is so adorable. I think I actually prefer like the scoop then the soft serve, this looks a lot more like ice cream. I like it, it's so cute. Now, we had opened up one of these blind bags in the store. This is the little Kumatan steam bun, and the packaging for this is really super cute. And there, um, I forget how many there are you can collect, but one of them is very rare, and that's the panda one, and that's the one that Ketchup Gary opened. So I have another one, and I'm gonna open this to see if I get the rare one, which is the panda one, and I'll be very sad if I get the pink one, because I already have the pink one. Oh, I got a different one at least. I got the yellow one. Very cute. There is a full-sized one of these. This is the mini version. Then we have this candy corn. Now, if I'm not mistaken, this candy corn is very rare. I think there's only like 30 of them or something. Like this one is very rare. This is like the rainbow colored candy corn. That's rainbow the whole body. I really like candy corn. I honestly don't know how I feel about the color being over the whole thing because I feel like it kind of washes out some of the details like the heart and the bow. It's kind of like lost but it's kind of unique in its own way. I feel like this is more like an artistic version of candy corn, but it is very, very cute and squishy and I do love the candy corn. I'm gonna put this one back in its bag because I think it's super rare. Now I saw these in her shop and I had to buy them. So I bought these two myself. These are the Polly in costumes. And I think they're so cute. I love Polly. Oh my gosh, this one has a little bell on it. Oh my gosh, so, so cute. So this is pulling a pig outfit and it's so cute. Look at the little tummy. There's like just barely a tail. I wish the tail was more prominent, but so stinking cute. Polly in outfits, like, yes, I will always get a Polly squishy. I love Polly so much. Then we have the Polly and the cow outfit and this one's really cute too. I love it. Polly is so cute and fat. I just can't get enough. Then we have some holy macarons and these are really cute also. The tags are just so cute. Oh, there's even a little tail on the back. That's really cute. And then I got a little poly donut and I am obsessed with the full-sized 
version of these. This is the mini size. Again, these tags, so stinking cute. I love it. How adorable. I just love Coley. Ooh, this one smells really good. Ooh, it smells amazing. This one is so cute. I love it. And look at the little butt. I love the little butt. So adorable. Love it. I love, love, love those. Then we have a bunch of these Fluff Fluff Loves Baking series. Now, Fluff Fluff is one of the mascots of Cutie Creative, which is the big hedgehog. And this tag is really, really cute. And this is like a little baguette with Fluff Fluff printed on it. And this is actually very, very squishy. Cute. And then there's also this bread with the same tag. And it looks like Fluff Fluff is eating a bread here. And then this one. These are all very, very squishy. And then lastly is this one, which is the mini Fluff Fluff Hugging Heart. And I have to be honest, I am not a huge fan of the shape of this. I feel like this doesn't really look like Fluff Fluff is supposed to. I think this is supposed to be like a baby version. But I feel like this is like, it was supposed to be a cat and then they just threw spikes on the back. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. I think it looks too much like a cat and not like a hedgehog. The back looks like a hedgehog, but I don't know. The head's a little bit too big. Oh wait, then there's also this toast, which it doesn't, doesn't say anything on the tag. Looks like it has butter on it. It's very squishy, which is kind of weird. I don't know. A big thank you to Santa from Bunny's Cafe. She literally showed me in Australia the best time ever. Like we literally went out on the town in San Francisco. She took us to this really cool karaoke bar and we had drinks and we sang karaoke and I was like the best time ever. We had such a great time and it was really great um, seeing everybody at the meetup. Was this the last meetup that we we're gonna have? Maybe. Um, I know that the squishy community is kind of dying down a little bit, so this may have been kind of the last big get together that we do. I'm not sure. Don't forget to check out bunniescafe.com and also follow Moodle Squish and Bunny's Cafe and me on Instagram if you're not already. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will talk to you later. Bye.